To write the formula for aluminum sulfate, we go to the periodic table and we look up aluminum, the element symbol for aluminum, that's Al. And sulfate, we won't find on the periodic table, we see it ends in A-T-E. Sulfate is a polyatomic ion. So we look this up on a table of common polyatomic ions and we see sulfate is SO4, two minus. Aluminum, that's a metal. And then sulfate, the sulfate ion, is made up of nonmetals, the sulfur and the oxygen. And we have a metal and nonmetals, we have an ionic compound, and we need to think about the charges on the aluminum, and then we know the sulfate, its charge is two minus. We go to the periodic table, we look up aluminum, it has a three plus ionic charge. And these charges here, they all need to add up to zero, to have a net charge of zero, for this to be a neutral compound, like aluminum sulfate. So right now, they don't add up to zero, but we can use something called the crisscross method to make that happen. We can move the two over here and the three out here. Let's get rid of the charges. And then we do need to put parentheses around the sulfate since it's a polyatomic ion, and we have three of them. So this is the formula for aluminum sulfate. Let's check our work real quick. Aluminum we said was three plus, and then the sulfate ion was two minus. So I have three sulfate ions, each one's two minus, three times two minus, that's six minus, and then two aluminum atoms, each one's three plus, two times three plus, that's six plus. So six plus and six minus, that adds up to zero, gives us a net charge of zero. This is the correct formula for aluminum sulfate. Let's clean it up. And that's it, aluminum sulfate, Al2SO4-3. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.